I'm Walter Day, the father of esports, and you're watching Maddie Mo's Arcade. And you know, I'm not stuck with black I'm getting ready to attack. Fanny pack attached. Tokens are all stacked. Got the mallet in my grasp. Waiting for the moles. Ha, hiding in their holes. Score, we're keeping tally. I'll be playing till they close now. Can't nobody beat my high score. You can't beat my high score. Can't nobody beat my high score. You can't beat my high score. I'm a mallet master, a single fisted blaster. You can ask my baby. Dark Soul then gets faster. I'm a record setter. My What's up, gang? I'm back at the warehouse. I'm looking at the Afterburner Climax. Um, this monitor is kind of going in and out a little wonky. It's a little green right now. It looks a little blue in the camera. The problem with the other one is it's missing this middle board here, um, which is just the power supply. As you can see we have AC coming in on this side for each. So each one of these is probably putting out a separate voltage. And that one runs this board here. So we definitely have to have power to get our game going there. Um, so what I'm going to try to just figure out, I'm going to make sure that this is all here. But I'm going to try to figure out uh, what this voltage is and then we can just put any power supply in here that's going to make that voltage so let's see okay so that other board is there and sorry for the light here so we just need to run the power here so basically all i need to do is just figure out voltage for that and uh if i had my little bench supply with me today i could go ahead and fire it up and we would see if it worked but it is over at the arcade so i'll have to do that another day but um i'm going to go ahead and pull my meter out and check that and figure that out and i'll let you know what it is in the next clip okay so that is a 24 volt supply run onto this little board that's over here i don't know exactly what it is but there is two of them it's kind of weird. It's not like there's two players. But I think that's all we need to get this one going. I, I do believe I pulled that board and tried it over here. Um, and I think everything worked fine. As you can see, there's like a wet spot and some soda spilled and went right through. I think it was this bolt hole and the floor. And the other one has a spot just like that. So that's kind of a, a weak point so you might want to put some grommets or something in there to keep uh, any spilled liquid from coming through but that would be much better to have two of those going man it's warm in here today um next i need to see if we can get one of those cart racers going and i need to get one or two of these hydro thunders out to go over to the arcade too plenty to do Woo. okay volume warning I found speakers that weren't either hooked up or they weren't turned on. Afterburner Climax. Here's the uh, a track mode playthrough. Full sound.
burner climax. Still got some monitor adjusting to do, but sounds great. All right, I'm gonna recap what I got. We have the Miss Pac-Man. Everything works fine, except for the monitor is just a little flaky. So I just want to reflow the solder. Afterburner is fine. Um, got a second one over here, and I figured out the problem with it. I'm gonna put some new feet on Donkey Kong Jr. We have a Hydro Thunder. Everything's ready to go on it, free play. A little monitor adjusting when we get it on location. Pac-Man, same thing, uh, a little bit of monitor issue. I think it's just reflowing the solder. And this Defender is, it, it needs a lot of work. Same thing, it's dirty. It's been rewired a little bit. But we have like two Defenders, so hopefully we can get one going out of all of those. Two Target Tears. Here's the Crisis Zone. We're either going to flip over to the other place or we're going to use it to fix the other one, one of the two. And then what do you think? We're going to set up this Black Knight tomorrow while we're here? We can set up this Black Knight and that Silver Mania yeah. uh, pinball, and uh, then I can tinker with those while I'm here. And oh yeah, we worked on this Space Invaders just boots the garbage, so I'm gonna clean it up and check it out too. It's in pretty good shape. Not as nice as the one I had. <laughs> Actually, it is in pretty good shape. This is the other target tear. Both are gold. And we want to find out how many of these power putts are 100%. And then we're also going to do this coin pusher too, I guess, right? Yep. It's dirty. I'll do, a, I'll do just a coin pusher video on that, and we'll put some, like, $100 bills on the edge like I'm winning them. <laughs> All right, well, stay tuned. Let's do that. <laughs> so these two right here are going to be ground and 5 volt. So what do we get here? Did I not turn the game on? I didn't turn the game on. I guess that would help. Hang on. Here it is. A nice little trade. The person I traded got what they wanted. I got what I wanted. And a pretty good deal on it too. Why did I get what I want? <laughs> <laughs> that comes later. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's, it's on fire. What happened? Whoa. Lots of smoke. Well, that's bad. Yeah, well, thanks for watching. <laughs> when you take care of people, people take care of you in this community. That's the truth. So everyone, please remember that. Even if we're competitors, we're not enemies.